Zebra Herd, welcome back to new Super Luigi U Deluxe. Today, we're gonna to be switching over to Blue Toad and then me moving on to the sixth world in the game, which I believe is gonna be the Rock Candy Mines. Looks like it, so yep. As it says right here, Rock Candy Mines. It took us a lot of hard work to get through the sort of jungle, but I honestly have a better feeling about the Rock Candy Mines. Maybe I'll be wrong about that. There's a lot of levels in this world as well, so it's gonna be quite a long journey throughout it, but at the end, we'll be able to take on Roy Koopa, and that'll definitely be interesting. But let's start with Rock Candy Mines 1, Mount Fuzzy. So, yeah, I guess we gotta deal with some fuzzies running around and everything, but you know what? I'm good to get back into it. I haven't played in a couple days, so we'll see what ends up happening. And we'll, I'm already forgetting about the slidey controls. The slidey controls are so weird sometimes. Okay, and is there anything up here? There's not a star coin, which is what I'm looking for. Because you know, the star coins sort of sneak by real fast, given that the levels are so short. Hmm, nothing going on with all of this, yet. <laughs> That's not good. I'm, I'm expecting to get beat up, and there we go. <laughs> I'm expecting to get beat up pretty fast throughout all this, because I gotta get used to playing, and this seems to be a weird level, one of the weird ones where it's just like, where are the star coins? Oh, this is star coin number three, where are the first two? You know, that kind of thing. <sighs> okay, so let's try again. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna be, I don't think these are invisible walls, or we'll have them, because you can sort of see right through them. That wouldn't make too much sense. Even though I think there may be something, no. Okay. Um. Well, I didn't get too much farther than right here, now did I? Okay, okay, there's, ah, a star coin that now just got a lot more difficult. What's with the mini toad? I don't like the look or sound of that, and that's a problem too. Okay, star coin number one. Oh, okay, it was star coin number one. We got a couple of extra coins as well, and a hidden little Luigi. Very cool. Watch it. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. It shouldn't be too bad, right? I hope not. Okay, oh, mistakes, mistakes. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. And then back over this way. Got it, okay, we get a nice flower for that, not bad. Only problem is that ate up a bunch of time, now we're down to 50 seconds, and I have... Okay, there we go, that was pretty good. That's why I need that ice flower. You need that for that, that's a little scary. Um, oh, okay, go for it. Even if I get hit, it's fine. That was awesome, we got it done. Very good stuff, so seven one, or six one is completed. Very cool, and yeah. The first level of many, I'm sure. But yeah, we're playing as Blue Toad this episode. I will be trying Nabbit next episode. We'll have to see what ends up happening with it. But for right now, we got a red button to press, so let's press it. That'll move the platforms over, which means we can deal with Rock Candy Mines 2, Porcupuffer Cavern. Alrighty. I mean, actually, I'm having a pretty good time so far, so I can only hope that continues here. Oh no, is this the one where the, I don't know. Oh, you know what, I probably should have searched that area for, deeper for star coins, because there was probably a star coin there. Um, is this auto-scrolling? No, it's not. Oh, it is him, he's a porky puffer? I mean, I guess it makes sense, he's sort of like a puffer fish as, all right, well, now we know, we got this. Um, all I wanna see is if there's anything on this side, there's not. I have a very strong feeling I've already missed the first star coin, but let's see if I'm wrong. Oh, I am wrong, awesome. Dodge that dude a little bit. And nothing over there. Watch out for you. Jump, boom. And I would love to use this to get rid of this dude. Oh, just barely missed. I'm just trying to search around. I would also love to get the red coin, red coin ring thing, because I'll probably need that ice flower. Come on, come on. Oh gosh, don't get hit. I am running out of time real fast in this level though. Like I'm just trying to thoroughly search it. I have a strong feeling I might end up dying in this level. Cause one of those is gonna have, oh come on, really? One of those is gonna end up having a star coin in it. What was that about? Oh I see, I see, I see. Has to be this. No, there's nothing up there? That pattern is deceiving. Oh wait, there was something. Wait, what, which, okay, I'm like trying to get over here. That's star coin number three. Then it definitely has to be over here. Wait, where was it? It was right here, right? It was, it definitely was. No wait, oh, it was over here. Got you, star coin number two. Tricky stuff. Okay, I got seven seconds left. Will I be able to make it? Most likely not, but I'll try. But I know where everything is though, that's the most important thing. I had to check so thoroughly, like that was a hard, four, three, two, one! Oh my gosh, we did it! That was so close! 
Oh my gosh! Wow, wait, because you die the absolute moment it hits zero, as far as I know. So, couldn't have gotten any closer. <laughs> wow, we. So, with that done, we're gonna move over here and press this blue button, and we're gonna move on over to the tower already. Now, I know there's gonna be secret exit in this tower because it was in the original, and it seems like all the secret exit spots are the same. So, we're going through Rock Candy Mine's tower, smashing Stone Tower, which I do not like these little things. So, this is gonna be a bit of a pain in the butt, and it already is proving to be so. Oh, is there going to be? Yes, there is. Oh, you broke it! Oh, come on, that was rude. Don't break that one too. Okay, he didn't, very good. Um, Okay, they're not breaking them anymore at the least. There's the first star coin. Pretty sure also, oh gosh, come on. Uh, Grab that. I'm pretty sure one of the star coins is going to be, oh gosh, be very careful here. Uh, this doesn't feel very careful right now, gotta be honest. That's a one-up, I, I, I guess I'll take that. Okay, now he's gonna destroy this stuff, gotcha. All right. Um. So he's gonna fall down there now. This is a mess. There's too many of them, there's too many. <laughs> oh my gosh. But I'm pretty sure one of the star coins is actually gonna be blocked off. What do you do here? Oh no. Oh, where are they coming in from? Oh, I don't like this. I don't like it. I don't like it. What is, what is with these downward arrows? Oh, we can go down these pipes, can't we? Oh, we definitely can. Do they launch us? They do. Ah, oh, but if we didn't do that, we could have gotten some secrets. Okay, well like I said, there's probably a, is there? There we go, symmetrical. <laughs> but um, there's probably a secret exit, and when we go for that, we'll also get the star coins. But for right now, boom, boom, it's time for round six. <laughs> Between me and you. We've beaten you five times. I don't think we'll have a hard time on the sixth, that's for sure. We'll try it out. What do you got this time? You get the wings! I know it's gonna happen sooner or later. All right, oh boy. Watch it, buddy. Watch it. You wanna try to dive under again? Oh, that missed. That just barely missed. Darn it. Okay. His dive is a lot more like sharper than I'd expected, especially with these controls. Hard to really do as much about as you'd expect. And, oh, almost got hurt again there. That would've been bad. Okay, ready, there we go. He's gonna pay attention to how his eyes are when he, like, like, as soon as he opens his eyes fully, that's when he's gonna jump up. So you just right at the time it correctly. There we go, we got it, we're fine. We beat him. And with that done, we gotta hop back in, but boom, boom, it's taken out. And that should lead to the third level and the fourth level. But I'm not worried about either of those. We're worried about a secret exit, so I'm gonna start poking around for that. So instead of going down either of these pipes, it gets a bit scary because I don't, oh, come on, that's not what I wanted to do. I don't know if we can make it up now. No, we can, we definitely can. We just gotta go up like that, and then there's a pipe to our left, and nothing to our right? What's to our right? Nothing, okay. That's what I had suspected, just didn't know for sure. So let's find out what's to our left. I mean, I still have no idea where the second and the third star coin are, so I, oh no, I need to be big toed? Really? Ah, oh, can't believe I made the mistake I did then because that's just gonna plop me out back here. Okay, so it's very, very important that I survive this without getting hit at all because if I get hit, it's not pretty. I have to do this all again because we gotta go up to this pipe and you can t probably tell I've already tried this and then realize, hey, look at this, I'm not big enough to get up here. And that's sort of the problem, right? Because, and that's star coin number three, so I still have no idea where star coin number two is. Oh my gosh, where could it be? I don't know, but we gotta, can we go up here? Uh, Is this not what I'm supposed to do? Where am I? I don't know. But I'm running out of time, so I gotta figure out what's going on here. Ah, here we go. It's gonna launch me up. Okay. That's great and everything, but where's the second star coin? <laughs> Come on. Jeez Louise, I gotta go through the level a third time now. Find out where that sinking star coin is. It's driving me nuts. Ah, <sighs> okay, okay, well that's great. So yeah, we got it done. <laughs> But I gotta go back into the level for a cabillion time, if you include all of the deaths, and figure that out. But it's good that we got a path to the, I think that's the seventh level. I think that's uh, Rock Candy Mine seven, so very good to see that done. Okay, I got hit, 
but I'm gonna try these pipes out. Okay, this one worked. Maybe it's this one. Um, oh gosh. Oh, we're fine, there it is, star coin number two. Finally, so I gotta make my way through. I mean, I guess I could try to take the secret exit so I don't have to fight Boom Boom again, but there we go. Star coin number two, I don't have to worry about anything. I can head out of here. All right, so with that done, what's going on around here? We got ourselves Rock Candy Mines three, Spikes Seesaws, oh boy. That doesn't sound easy. We'll try it out, we'll see what ends up happening. I'm glad we finally got that tower done. That was treacherous. Um, Okay, there's star coin number one, and I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Let Spike do his spike thing again. I keep doing that, I don't mean to. I promise I don't, and I got hit anyways. All this time, trying to be careful, didn't work out very well. Oh gosh, that was really lucky, actually. Um, no, <laughs> that was that was like the opposite of a good start. I just kept messing up my jumps, I go right into the spike ball. Ah, come on, get back in there. Can't believe it. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. So uh, yeah, we'll try that again. And let's be careful, nice. And I'll try to get this now, perfect. Not so bad so far. Okie doke, moving, moving. And then there's definitely gonna be something going on with him. So let's slam through here, what do we got? Star coin number two, nice. Okay, so, so far so good with this level. I like it. Hmm. Oh no, ooh, almost got hit by that. Can the Seavasol come back or what? It takes a while, that's a little concerning. I'm running out of time. Come on, are you serious? Leave me alone with that thing and of course it went right on top of me. Was that necessary? Absolutely not, but it still happened. Okay, um, uh, got it, got it. I gotta get these three and then jump and there we go, we got a fire flower. Oh boy, I do see a hidden Luigi over there. I don't know if that'll actually be anything. Where is the star coin? There's too much stuff going on. Oh, it's over there. Okay, that's actually pretty easy. Got him, got it, nice. So we don't have to worry about anything else. Get the heck out of here. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, get rid of this dude. Nice. Nice, okay, one up. Very cool. So that level went pretty well after we tried it once, so that's pretty good. So actually, so far, we're getting through this world moderately quickly. We got three levels and a tower done, which means we still have a tower, castle, and like four levels to do, which is still quite a lot, but definitely making a better pace than what we typically do. Definitely wanna get that blue Yoshi at some point, the blue baby Yoshi. But for right now, we got Rock Candy Mines 4 Light Up Lift Tower. Now this one doesn't, I think there's only one other level in this area that has a secret exit. But for right now, oh, if we could get a golden baby Yoshi here, that'd be great. Hmm. Oh, so I see, it lights up and it lifts. And I'm already late for my lift, so that's very bad. And there's star coin number one. I gotta get over there. Uh, never mind. Ooh, that's weird. If I picked up a Koopa shell, I could have thrown it right at it, so <laughs> maybe I should have done that. Let's try that again. Okay. Light up lift tower. You're going down this time, I know what I'm doing, maybe. So let's not land on the tower part until we're ready, which I am. And that was really dumb of me. <laughs> Why'd I do that? Okay, we're up this way, there's the star coin, and throw it, and it missed. Oh my gosh, I can't see. I mean, that's the entire point. Okay, we got lots of coins, but no star coin yet. Hmm, I don't trust it. There it is, there it is. Right, star coin, oh, come on, really? Ah, oh, darn it. All right, well, gotta try that again. <laughs> all right, so I'll play it safe and just go this way for now, because that guy gets rid of all those, and then, I mean, if this works the way I think it does, I don't know if it does, I can maybe get rid of him. Yes, perfect, perfect. Now, I'm running out of time for this. Go, go, go. Yeah, I made it so far. This is pretty good, pretty good. These piranha plants aren't making this very friendly though. Oh, that, seriously, that was lame. That was just straight up lame. Where is this last star coin though? Oh, I see it up there. I don't have too much of a hope of getting it though with this jerk in the way. Come on. There it is. Now don't hit the fireball. Hoo wee, we did it. Somehow, somehow, some way we got there. That was awesome. Okay, so I'll keep moving, just ignore this dude. 
Thank you. And I got the one up too. Pretty cool, pretty cool. So, 39 lives in total, all three star coins. That was not so bad. Not so bad at all. Maybe we're just getting lucky with Blue Toad, you know? It's always good to know. <laughs> Alrighty, so, with that, as you can see, that unlocks the blue switch over here, which we, we will go over and grab this Yoshi. I feel like seeing how I am doing okay on lives, I'd rather not use the one-up huts until I really, really need them. Like maybe I'll need them as Nabbit or some other character. I'm not really sure yet, so I wanna hold on to them until then. Uh, Rock Candy Mines 5, R Rising Piranhas. Now this is the one that should have a secret exit in it somewhere, like the original did. So we'll have to look for that. In the meantime, we got his little baby Yoshi and hopefully a mushroom somewhere around here. Uh, there it is, very good. But this is the bubble Yoshi. Can we hop on top of the bubbles? This was a really risky thing to do all of a sudden. <laughs> um, I think we can. Yeah, we can just press this button to do them. Hmm. Oh, and that's a nice flower. Okay. I'm pretty sure, okay. I didn't really need it, but I'll take it. I'm pretty sure this is one of those, okay, yeah, we can. That's pretty cool, actually, I like that. Um. Turn you into a bubble so I can check out this. There we go. Seems simple enough, right? But this is the level that like, no, come back, where are you going? Oh, baby Yoshi, why'd you do that? This is one of the ones, oh, acorn suit. Yeah, it definitely is. Where I have to like fly up into somewhere to get it. I'm not gonna do it just yet. Ooh, watch it, buddy, watch it. Okay, there it is, there it was. Okay, get back down here and land on this Koopa. And then, mm, oh my gosh, I did it. Okay, I got hit, but it was well, well worth it. That was crazy, I can't believe I did that. So let's not fall into a pit and die. Let's get to the end of the level, no matter what it takes. There it is, I don't care if we get the one up. So now we're gonna go back into that level with an acorn suit, so if we can be careful, we can get to that one spot with it. And then we gotta fly up into the, the roof, because that's how it was in the original level. It was, just, it was sneaky, I remember that much. So that actually went really well. I'm, I'm impressed with myself. I mean, it was more luck than anything, so maybe I shouldn't be all that impressed, I don't know. But hey, for now, can't worry about it. We gotta go back into this Rising Piranhas level and get that secret eggs in. And hopefully it turns out okay. I mean, I can dodge most of, most of this stuff. It isn't really worth my attention too much if I ha don't have Baby Yoshi. Okay, oh no. Ooh, that was close. I need to be able to be at least Big Toad um, until we get a little bit farther, right here. So this one should give me the acorn suit. Okay, yeah, fly over that. Oh, that almost hit me, that would've been bad. Because I think it's, if not here, then a little to the left. So maybe I, I shouldn't have gone over this way at all. Oh, no, are you serious? That's baloney. Was that it? Oh, I think we got it, yes, we got it. It's weird, once you're up there, you sort of have to jump again. Huh, odd. So this should be the secret exit. This guy's gonna be waddling around. I don't really care too much about him. And boom, one up as well. All right. <laughs> what in the world? But hey, we got it done, which is the most important thing. So uh, where does that one lead? I think that just leads around, so yeah, that we can press that button if we needed to, because there's some levels we can get to and some we can't. But yeah, like now in technicality, we could go up to the secret entrance to the castle. Sort of, kind of, I need to beat this first. So let's go to Rock Candy Mines Tower, Super Bros Spinning Tower. This was tough in the original. I can only imagine it's gonna be tough now. Um, And I timed that awfully. <laughs> well, there we go. And there's not gonna be a power up in there for me. I could have used, I could have used, you know, a, a raccoon suit in a situation. Not a raccoon. You know what I mean. I'm just not even gonna get bother. <laughs> they're not even raccoons. They're tanookis, which are different. Oh, this. Oh, I thought for a second the platform actually had a fire bar connected to. It. I was like, well, that's next level difficulty. Okay, that has an ice flower in it, but we have an ice power up for now. Probably could have used it there. <laughs> oh. Okay, got him. No, we got hit. Should I go back for it? Is it too risky? I feel like it's too risky. Um, I can't land on the top of this guy. Gotta keep that in mind. And, oh boy. Dodge all of that as much as I can. Luckily, the electricity doesn't seem to spread onto the platform like it does most other things. Huh. Oh, it's, yep, it's up there. No, that hit him. But can I actually still get up there? There has to be a way. How do I get up there? 
I don't know. Maybe I need the triple jump? There we go. There we go. There it is. It had to be the triple jump, right? It just had to be. Okay, let's look around for a power-up real fast. I mean, obviously that could have helped as well. There we go. This is what we're supposed to do. Give me that mushroom. And is there actually, okay, I can't check anymore. Need to just keep moving. <laughs> oh my gosh, there we go. 118 seconds to take care of a sumo bro boss, but this boss is tough. So we messed up, we gotta do it all over. So we gotta be fast. We gotta be quick. We gotta be capable. All right, sumo dude. What you gonna do here? Hopefully nothing too scary, right? But probably something scary. Who am I kidding? Come on, what was with that weak jump? I mean, I guess it sort of saved me. There we go, there we go, but we're not done yet. I need to slam on him, boom. Very good, very good. So he's not gonna like that very much, but what is he gonna do about it? Uh, boop, whole bunch of nothing. So if you're fast about it, that's really good to know. If we're fast about it, he'll jump right back onto this platform and we'll just knock him back down again. Oh, I found the code to this boss fight. I found out how it works. I've reverse engineered it. There we go. Not bad at all. So Sumer Bro and his tower were taken down on the first try. And that means we can keep moving forward. Like I said, we could sneak on over to the back end of the castle. We're not gonna do that now. Good to keep in mind, that's probably where we'll get the third star coin. Save now, awesome. Go ahead and press this blue switch, which will you know, do that, which is what we want. So we can press the red one. Move on over to this level, which of course is Rock Candy Mine 7, Switch Lift Express. So let's get to it. This one might be a little bit interesting. Switch lifts, is it gonna be in a cave? I thought for a second it was gonna rock me up. Rocket me up, <laughs> I don't know. Um, whoa, we're moving fast. Wow, that was weird. Okay, I'm guessing if we could just, that seems to be a tough jump. I don't know if I'm doing this correctly, but that's the way I'm doing it, star coin number one. Huh, very weird. And what is this about? Whoa! Whoa, whoa, this is a weird level. I love it. <laughs> I love the weird levels. Okay, oh, 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 that's what it does. That's a good to know. <laughs> I got every single coin too, that was awesome. Um, weird. Oh, what's up here? Um, getting some coins, which is awesome, and I'm skipping a ton, but I now can sort of lay out the land a little bit. I'm gonna throw that Koopa shell, because I know it's gonna move. We know where two out of the three star coins are then. I mean, well, two out of three, and we already got one of them, so pretty good combo, if you ask me. Was that what I was supposed to do there? It was not. Oh, no. Wait a minute. Where were those coins coming? What was going on over there? Dang it, fire, bro. Why do you find a way to ruin everything? Okay, so what I think I gotta do here is that the, the gap is already open. I just need to dodge the fire, bro, jump on top of him, and keep moving. Now, I know there's another star coin right here. Okay, I am glad that was the correct button because I was the one I accidentally pressed, and we made it. So once you know what to do and where to go and how to dodge and weave, it's actually not that bad if that is the end of the level. I mean, I think it is. Okay, um, that was scary. Um, and we made it, okay, there we go, we got it. So that was that level, whichever one that was. I think that was the sixth level, so we need, now need to march back and do the skeleton roller coaster level, which will be fun. And I need to double check, I don't think that there is a, what's it called here? I don't think there is a, a special level in this world, but we'll find out in a moment. But that actually leads back there, which is quite convenient for what we're trying to do. So um, yeah, real quick, let me check. Um, Star coins, there's not. Oh, that was the seventh level. Oh, I did them out of order, that's a shame. Oh well, that's fine. Let's go ahead and deal with this one then. Oh, I'm super bummed I did them out of order. It's fine, it's fine. Rock Handy Mines 6, Spine Coaster Stowaways. I don't know why they would order it that way. It's sort of weird when you think about it, but let's try it. Can't be that difficult, right? Please. I mean, some of the spine coasters have been really crazy in the original, especially in the special world. They had that really tough one. Okay, there's star coin number one. How do I get it? How do I, that's a good question. That's a good question, Zebra. You, you don't get it. Or maybe it just keeps going. I, that was that was very peculiar. Because usually star coins don't usually follow little lines like that. They just fall, but that one likes to break the rules. <laughs> this is very weird so far. And there was a little piece which I could have pressed as well, which I probably have to press. Probably, you know, opens up like another set of blocks or something. 
Okay, jump over that, jump over this. Oh, I got it, okay, that was lucky. That was real lucky. Press that button, and I don't know what that's gonna do for me, but I'm gonna be on alert. There it is, no, star coin number, number two. <laughs> It's right there. That's not really fair because the camera doesn't really show it to you. The camera's like way off and not even paying attention to that. So that doesn't really make any sense to me why they would do it that way. Let's try it again though. We know where it is. We just gotta be prepared for it. Jump at the right time, we'll be fine. So, got it. Nice. Oh boy. So let's see if we can't get lucky with that first star coin jump again. We do, very good. Once again, I still don't know if this P switch is actually going to help us with anything, but I might as well try. If not anything else, it gives you a little bit of a guide on where you're supposed to go there, which is nice. Yeah, I guess I'm avoiding all those dudes. Oh, they're on here now, and our movement's too slippery to really dodge them all that much. <sighs> is this really necessary? Is this situation truly, truly necessary? Oh, it's moving so slow now. Hurry it up, hurry it up, we're gonna get out of here. Oh, leave me alone. Come on, where is that third star coin at? Jump, 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 and jump. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? I gotta do it again. <laughs> Might as well just go under with them. <laughs> but I know where all three of them are though, so that's the big thing. There it is, that was a tough jump to make, that's for sure. And now we gotta get over here, because why not? I don't know what's going on with all that, and I do not care. <laughs> We got to the end of the level. That was a tough one, for sure. Super duper tough just to get that last star coin because you need to do like two little quick hops, which makes sense for Mario, but for Luigi, when you have those extra long slippery jumps, it gets tough to do that in succession like that. Okay, so with that done, we can march our way back to the castle, finally, and get that done. And then we'll be all done. We just have to probably play that castle twice, once for the first two star coins, and another time for the one in the back entrance. I can only imagine. But there we go, Rock Candy Mines Castle, Roy's Ironclad Castle, which I think is the same name for the original. Oh, and more of this button presses. Oh, here we go. Star coin number one. I mean, I'll go quick through it, but I'll try my best to find everything if there maybe is a, oh, 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 okay, hold on. Ooh, ooh, close, I don't know how I survived that. That is a mystery that will remain through the ages. I wanna try to hop up there, but I also absolutely do not trust it, <laughs> which means that there's most definitely a star coin. Okay, uh, pressing this button will probably make this thing fall. I can't hit the button though. There we go, okay. Um, How does this work? Um. I'm getting the feeling I gotta be over here, and that looks like it's about correct. Got it, and now I'm gone. Okay, so far so good, actually. I say that, and this is looking really bad. So, gotta be careful, ow, that hurt. I'm over here now, and that's presumably the end. <laughs> okay, no star coin number three in that mix, but it's gonna be over here, yep. Okay, so that's fine. We got to the end of the castle on the first try and got the first two star coins, which means all we gotta worry about now is defeating Roy so that we can go back through it an additional time for the back entrance and get the third star coin as well. Super duper awesome. I can't wait for it. Yahoo, nice. Okay, very cool. <laughs> All right, Roy, you are going down if I have anything to say about it. Hopefully you're not too tough of a boss fight because I can only take one hit here, or one extra hit, I suppose. Oh, it's this one, I do remember this. Got him, good start actually, good start. Dodge that, he moves pretty fast. You definitely gotta be careful, I think he's gonna pop out somewhere soon. Uh, maybe not, he's going for much longer than I had expected. Boop, got him, now my main goal is just to make sure that he doesn't really get too far, too much farther than what he has. And if he pops out in the center, then I know what to do. So he's probably gonna pop out on this one. Oh no, ooh, he did it differently! Whoa, that was close, that was really close. But we did it! First try and everything. We get Roy Koopa taken down along with his castle. So now all we gotta do is do it one more time. I'm happy about that, so far so good. Beating that thing up a little bit. And Rock Candy Mines, while it was tough, honestly wasn't as much of a headache as Soda Jungle was for me. That was a really, really challenging one. So I'm glad we got that done without too much of a problem. And there he goes. So, let's try it out. Uh, you know, that path's gonna open up to the next world, which we won't be bothering with now. We'll be bothering with that in the next episode. One last thing left to do, and I hope it's not tough, is just to get to that back end. So to do that from here, we just gotta press this button, go down this way, press this red button, 
go back up, and we are good. Just the same way we did it in New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe. All right, so entering through here, we got Roy's Iron Cloud Castle, the back entrance. Ooh. And let's hope this isn't too bad. There's the star coin, which means this will you or require a maintain amount of, uh, what am I saying? Maintain a good amount of timing. Ooh, I don't trust that. <laughs> Ooh, I most certainly don't trust this. There we go, there's my mushroom. So at this point, you guys have already seen me fight Roy Koopa. I'm not gonna make you sit through it again. I'll be right back once we're out of here. But now you know where the third star coin is, which is good. Okay, so, star coin number three. Everything should be good. Let's see Toad Dance, there it is, awesome. So that means we've got all the star coins and rock candy mines. Very cool, so a little bit more progress into the game. I am happy with this one. Honestly, turned out pretty gosh darn well if you ask me. So next episode, we'll be tackling the next world, and yeah, that'll be fun. I'll try to play a little bit more as Nabbit. I don't know how far we'll get with it, but we'll just try to play some and see if I can't get some star coins that way. That's sort of the problem though is, I mean, I guess I'll talk about that in the next episode. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of New Super Luigi U Deluxe. If you watch this part of the video, make sure you comment Blue Zebra, so you watch at the end of it, you're a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Out of the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye-bye.